Weather changes all the time. It can be rainy one minute and sunny the other, cold in one part of the country and hot in another. Predicting how, where, and when your weather changes starts not on Earth, but in space. NOAA's satellites are one of the main tools used by weather forecasters all over the country. They not only take pictures of storms, but also detect subtle changes in energy on the planet and broadcast the data back to Earth. Anyone with a proper satellite dish can receive this data, but NOAA's receiving stations are the main download sites for almost everyone in the world. The data from one satellite is processed by computers in Maryland from ones and zeros into meaningful data, such as temperature, moisture, and pressure. This data is also available to anyone in the world. The National Weather Service combines the data from all NOAA satellites and other sensors to create complex weather models that predict how dozens of different components of Earth will change around the world over the next several days. Humidity, pressure, temperature, and many others. These weather models run four different times a day and are the basis for almost every weather forecast that you receive. Once the models are generated, meteorologists take the conditions in their local area and develop forecasts. That meteorologist could be your local NOAA weather forecast office, your local news station, or one of many commercial weather providers. Though your local television station may provide a 10-day forecast, only NOAA generates the severe weather advisories, watches, and warnings that protect us from tornadoes, hurricanes, floods, blizzards, and other dangerous conditions. Ultimately, it doesn't matter where you get your weather from, but getting it to you all starts in one place, hundreds of miles above your head.